Hi guys, so today we're finally gonna try this Swift Burn Skull. Wings. Um, might wanna like warm up the grill first, so you know. Time to do the rain dance, guys. Almost ready. You know, people like to see us get hurt. I'm just gonna do it, you know. Yeah. Again, it's disgusting, but. Hi right, guys, so today we're finally gonna try this Swift Burn Skull. I've been asking this guy for a while. He wanted to try this. Uh, shouldn't be too bad, it only got the red chili uh, and garlic and habanero powder. Why not just habanero? Habanero powder. Cheaper, so, I guess. Yeah, so there we go, finally. All right. Chicken, wings. It's marinated, what's in there, man? Yeah, it's just regular marinade, man. Just pepper, lemon, and uh, garlic. Um, might wanna like warm up the grill first, so it, you know, sizzles right away. It's, it's, yeah. it's not hot yet. Oh, there's a lot, man. Uh, more or less? I think Let's just do all. Uh oh. KC likes to put, you know, meat, chicken on a cold grill. It's not even sizzling. Nope. Not yet. I call it slow cooking. Yeah. You know, and that should be good. I mean, it's always good when he cooks chicken, you know. I usually overcook mine. Easy too much. peasy, guys. Easy peasy. So last time our buddy Dan tried, uh, well, we made him to try the bomb sauce, and I don't think he's coming over today. I don't think we're friends anymore. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, that was pretty bad. But hoping this one is gonna be nice and tasty. Okay, the rain is coming. And we're slow cooking the chicken here. Look at the temperature, guys. That's not good. Time to heat it up. <sighs> yep, bring crank, up the, crank it up, sir. Crank up the All heat right. seekers. Uh, please don't come this way. What are you doing? Oh, I'm just uh, checking the plants. You know, I'm a plant guy. I feel the rain. I feel the rain, buddy. No. There you go, guys. It's coming down. No. Time to do the rain dance, guys. <laughs> do Time to do the rain dance. <laughs> Not gonna stop us. You're good, buddy. Yeah, this looks oh, perfect timing, man. We're getting there. 20 more minutes. Almost. Chicken wings look good. KC looks good. Showtime, guys. Good. Swift Burn is here. Uh, yeah, could you remind me how much was that bottle, that big ass bottle? You know, I you found know? this for $10, man. $10. You know bucks. I mean? It could be at the thrift store or whatever. How good do you think it is for $10? <laughs> as, as far as the consistency, it, it looks kind of. It's got Zentum gum in it. Watery. So. Let's see how it tastes, right? Let's mix it up real well. Okay, okay. Let me see. It smell kind of reminds me of a A1 sauce. Oh yeah, it smells just like A1. Guys, we're gonna try the sauce, all right? Let's There's check out the uh, consistency of the sauce. The $10 is bottle. Is it watery or is it thick, nice and thick? I like it nice and thick, please. Okay. Yeah, it's not bad. Oh, all right. All right. Oh man. You first, man. Go, go for it. Uh, me first? Okay. Well, yeah. I don't know what to expect from a $10 bottle, but let's see. That's sour. It's not bad. Mm. It's not spicy. Maybe like one out of 10. Mm -hmm. Not too sour, not too um, salty. Damn, this is like, I can just like, you know, dip this. Yeah, you can definitely drench it, man. 
something like that. So yeah, I agree with you, man. The spice level is maybe a 0.5 to 1. Yeah. Slightly sour, slightly salty. I mean, it doesn't live up to, you know, the skull. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, you would think it's a lot of danger. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, um, it's pretty mild. I actually like the taste. Mm -hmm. Even though it, it smells like A1, mm -hmm. it doesn't taste like A1. To me, this is a good daily hot sauce. Yeah. Because uh, I think my kid's going to eat it. I think anybody can eat it. Since it's uh, not too spicy. I actually like the flavor. Not too strong. Mm -hmm. Good, good to, uh, I mean, think about it. You know, you keep this on the table. It looks nice as a, a decorative <laughs> um, item. I was hoping it would be like spicy, you know? Mm -hmm. Give us some challenge, some with, kick. Yeah, with the skull, you know, you think it's gonna give you death or something like, <laughs> like that. You, you know, people like to see us get hurt. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, <laughs> not this time. We, we can't, yeah. not with this bottle, but. You know, I mean, ne next time let's get something serious. How about that? We can do the, that. the Amazon special, you know, the instant regret. Yeah, let's I get do. That. I miss. Uh, I, I I agree with you, man. I miss the spice level. You know, like we both getting a, a kick. We have the bomb. Yeah, we do have the bomb. <laughs> I actually thought about mixing. Yeah, but next time we do. It's a good base sauce. Let's do some serious. Like I want to get hurt. It's been a while. Yeah, you know? it's been a while. It's been a while. Of all the sauces that you tried, right? One to ten, what would you give it? The flavor-wise, or like overall? Overall. Actually, like, dude, I can eat this. This is good. Maybe like five, you know, in somewhere in the, in the between one and ten, somewhere in the five. I can eat this with anything. So. You know, for me, I would give it probably four That's because close. it's got some peppers in there, but you don't really smell it. It, it does have a scent, but you don't really have like the garlic or the lemongrass or the pepper smell, yeah. you know. So I think if they add some kind of scent in there with the garlic or lemongrass. This is garlic in there, but yeah. I don't really smell it or taste it, but it's, it's good flavor. It's, it's kind of like sweet and sauce. salty, yeah. I want it more spiced though. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately. Sorry to disappoint, but this is not yeah. <laughs> you know what it looks like. I am disappointed on the spice, spice level. level. Yeah. The taste is uh, underwhelming for those professional tasters, seasoned tasters, but for beginners, this is perfect. It's good, yeah. Beginners, off the table, just leave it there. You don't go give it to your kids. If I had this, I would never have ketchup. You know, ketchup is uh, make some bloody marys with this. You know? <laughs> yes, <laughs> and, you know, bloody mary would go good yeah. with that. We're gonna have to try that. Happy holidays, guys. Happy holidays. All right. I'm just gonna do it, you know? Yeah. Again, it's disgusting, but you know, you guys wanna see people get hurt, you got it. Well, we were uh -oh. eating it. <laughs> we were eating it with the uh, I already, stone sauce. Yeah, I already forgot how bad this is. Yeah, and look how much we had to use, you know what I mean? Yeah, but this is, this is, enough. look at the amount on this guy. That looks tasty though, man. Yeah, there you go, the bomb again. Try with the bomb like that? And yeah, then man. mix it with the bomb yes. and disgusting. <laughs> it's a good sauce to keep you warm though. Uh oh. It's one of those sauces where you eat, right? You taste first and then every other sauce would taste better. Because it doesn't taste like a burnt rubber. Uh oh. It's kicking in. Napkin. Somebody's on fire. <laughs> I don't know what was it, dude. That kicks in like. So you've tried the sauce uh, three, four times already. You know, have you gotten used to the taste, the smell? It's, it's really got a distinct flavor taste. Nice. Rub, burnt rubber. Maybe those uh, mechanics, you know, auto mechanics, they would like that <laughs> taste. Oh my God! I forgot what this is. Mm -hmm. This is bad. <laughs> Yes. You didn't take as much as our buddy Dan the other day. I took more. Are you kidding me? I put it straight on a chicken. <laughs> oh my God, I can't. Use the other sauce now. Maybe it will help, uh, help it out. Great job, man. Nothing but pain. <laughs>